children. Now I was watching my daughter, Lena, just the other day. Lena Nightstar. And I couldn't believe my eyes. She hit something. She fell down. She cried. She got up. She started walking towards me. Ah, ah, ah. Interested in everything. Expanding. Trying to figure it out. Boom, hits a chair. Wow, yeah! It's bad. It's the end of the world. And then, hmm, not so bad. She gets up. Yeah. She gets cruising again. Me, I'm like Einstein with the unified field theory. Yes! That's it. Phones ring. Phones ringing. Who's on it? Pick it up. It's an activist. Art Not Oil. Liberate the Tate. They're from London. We'll be with them July 18th. They have in their voice the same thing that Lena just had. Joy. Joie vivre. I am expanding. I just want to know more. Amen, praise be. Let me have it. What's the information? What's the experience? Yeah, yeah, I'm an activist. I'm learning a lesson that we haven't had in the United States for so long among the activists. Joy, humor, <laughs> zealotry, invincibility, joy, expansion. Amen. We've been morbid. We've been contracting. We've got our little signs. We're imitating 60s protest people so that the media can say, oh, and the protesters that were over there, and they did this, and they said that, and now, well, that's enough of them. Amen? No. No, let's reinvent activism. Somebody give me an act of hallelujah here. Amen, praise be. Can you imagine? We come into the Bank of America. They're financing the coal-fired fired power plants. We take the elevator up to the executives, and there we are, and we're approaching them, and we are full of that joy. <laughs> yeah. Change. <laughs> Change your investments. Stop with the CO2 emissions. Amen, praise be. <laughs> yeah. Whoa. Hallelujah.